Wall, South Dakota is located off of I-90 about 50 miles east of Rapid City. It has a population of about 800 people, but each year over 2 million visitors stop by. Why? Wall Drug, America's number one roadside attraction. It all started with free ice water. Since 1931, Wall Drug has been educating and entertaining the traveling public right here in South Dakota. And it all started with your family. It all started in 1931. My grandparents bought this business uh, from a little bit of money that my grandfather inherited from his father. Like my grandmother came up with a perfect marketing plan. On a hot summer day in the middle of 1936, she gets a babysitter to watch my father. She runs up town to tell her husband we gotta try and stop the people that are going by wall on Highway 14, going to Mount Rushmore in Yellowstone. And he goes, well, how are we gonna stop them? She said, let's put up a sign and advertise free ice water. It's 105 degrees in the shade today. So my grandfather thought, well, that's a little quirky, but maybe it'll work. So he put up a series of signs. Slow down the old hack, wall drug just across the railroad track. Free ice water with an arrow. <laughs> this is a Megalodon tooth, a prehistoric shark, and a big one as you can see. And this is a cast of a real tooth. A real tooth would cost you $5,000. A wall drug, I can put one in your hands for $24.98. We got a chapel right here that uh, was it was really modeled after a, a chapel in Dubuque, Iowa, a, a monastery. And we uh, have a lot of weddings in here. A lot of people write us, call us, and say, I want to get married at Waldrop. And we say, well, you can do that. This is a replica of the original Wall Drug store. And this is my grandfather standing out in front of it in 1931. Now I've pointed this out to lots of people and sometimes people think I'm pointing to the skeleton. But grandpa is right here. We didn't hang grandpa up in the window. We sell the same cologne that George Washington wore uh, when he was a young man. Really? And we have the same cologne that President John F. Kennedy wore, and we have the same cologne that Lafayette wore. What was the cologne that Kennedy wore? Because we all know how it worked out for him with the ladies. Uh, he, he wore Jockey Club, and uh, if I can find it, I will show you Jockey Club. Of old John F., he did have so much good luck that's what I'm talking about. I'm going to try a little. Yeah, I'll give you a little too. Who knows what might happen. Not bad. We're going to head into the boot department where we have 9,000 pair of boots and probably have 4,000 too many. <laughs> uh, this pair of boots, Diamondback Rattler. This pair of boots is, is Kaiman. Cayman, is it Cayman? Cayman? Cayman Lizard? Cayman Lizard. Let's just go with that. Let's go with Cayman Lizard. <laughs> Wall Drug has got some of the best hot beef sandwiches, roast beef dinners in the country. All right, Ted, there's so much to see. Thank you for the tour. I don't even know where to start. Please tell our viewers on the internet watching us all over the world why they should come to Wall Drug. You don't want to miss Wall Drug because it is the number one roadside attraction in America, if not the world. And if you're thirsty, you get free ice water. water. Free ice water. Thanks very much. Hey, thank you.